Hey everybody, it's John with ClearPlan. Today I want to show you a new feature we're going to be releasing here shortly called Zone Details. So as you can see right now, I'm on our current zones page. And when I scroll down the page, we can see all of our zones and they're all broken down into each individual zone. And then within each zone, you'll see that we have total number of addresses, total number of new addresses, any addresses that have only seen one time, and then right here in red, we've got the total number of addresses that haven't been seen in five days. So this new feature we're going to be releasing, Zones Details, takes this a whole step further. So let's dive into that. To get into the Zone Details page, all you need to do is click on this bullseye right here. And that takes us into the Zone Details. So as you can see right now, we're looking at the Zone Any one which is our Northeast 1 zone. And down below that, we've got the zone broken into four segments. The first segment is Accounts. The next one is clients, the next one's agents, and we have icons. So let's start first with accounts. And on this accounts tab, we've got all of our accounts listed here. So as we scroll down the page, we can see all of our accounts. And from here, you can do a number of different things. We can sort, we can look at advanced alerts, repossessions, and so on. We can also sort by, so we can look at last check-in, order date, or by client. Right here tells us the total amount of addresses in that zone. The really cool thing is we can multi-change icons now. So let me give you an example. So if we're looking by last check-in, we can see that these, this account, it's been 34 days since last check-in. This one's been 24 days. This one down here is 13, and this one's 13, right? So those, those accounts definitely need some help. So one of the really cool things we can do now with the details page is we can multi-change the icons. So let me show you how to do that. To change these icons, all I need to do is click on this checkbox. So I'm going to click these three icons. Then I'll come over here to Actions, click on Change Icon, and now I get a list of every icon available to me. And so what I want to do in this case is I want to make these all a priority, right? They've been a long time since anybody's seen these accounts. Let's make them priority so that our agents will get in there and hit those accounts. So I just simply choose Priority, click on Save Changes, and boom, you can see all three of these accounts are now priority. So we think that's a that's a huge benefit for you guys on the Zones Detail page, especially for people running the office. You can come in here, you can sort accounts, look for anomalies within there, and then make changes. So let's move on to the Clients tab. So now if I click on Clients, this will show me all the clients that I have in the zone. We've got 20 total clients in this zone. And as we scroll down, we just list all of the clients. So the cool thing is now you can take action. So if we take this Tiger Financial, we see we've got 15 total accounts in here. Two of them are new. Seven have only been seen once. And we've got five that haven't been seen in five days. So now as, as someone in the office, so now we can take action on this account. We can click on these seven icons that only have single check-ins, and we can go run these accounts. Okay, the next tab we have is Agents. So if I click on Agents for this one, what we show you here is that we've got two agents that are running the zone. We can see these two agents right here, and we also tell you the last time the zone was ran. Another cool thing with our Agents tab is, from here, we've given you the option to add an agent to this zone. So if I click on this button right here, it brings up a list of all of our agents. And if you wanted to add somebody here, you can simply click on them, save changes, and that agent will be added to that zone. The last tab within Zone Details is our Icons. So if I click on icons, it's going to show me that I have 86 total accounts, and it's going to break down every single icon that I have in that zone. Another cool thing in our zone details is we give you a quick change right here. So we can choose any of these other zones. So if I wanted to go and see Northeast 2, I just click on it. Now I'm looking at Northeast 2. So we're super excited about this new feature. It will be released to everybody here shortly. As always, let us know if you guys have any questions. 